Hello and welcome back to the channel. So this is something that is trending there on TikTok and as a blogger that does rely on Musa Kawula for fresh trends, I was even asking myself, I think last week I was like, hey, well, what happened to Musa when it was really dry last week? I was like, what dry? And I was like, where is Musa Kawula? I really need him at this point because he would be giving me like fresh scoops and I would be coming back here to you guys to report on that that but unfortunately i bumped to this daily sun article whereby they are alleging that actually umu sakawula was issued with a warrant of arrest on the 20 on the 23rd of january uh, due to the fact that he failed to appear at the Varenberg magistrate court for her ongoing murder case of elate ex-boyfriend uwandile kambole you guys kutwage umusa kawula has a tendency of missing his court dates and being absent kutwabambize bambize several times umusa kawula angalupa dinje kwa yena a court and that when he is present when he does go to court kutwa yo abe umtu o gula enga ti uzo hamba so go to what the last time he did go to court he was limping and he couldn't walk properly and he basically told his lawyer Ugoti he had um hurt his ankle or something along those lines but we all know the people that follow him he did share on um on my instagram spaces with he indoor diamonds are rubbish <laughs> as a result he could not walk so recently i also bumped into his video on tiktok sharing why he has not been on the socials let me just insert it for you guys to see and then i'll be back with the rest of my commentary I, I'm always going to something. <laughs> Good things come to those who wait, bitch. Period. Where's the music coming? Wait, I tell you, I'm Westgate. Hey, Westgate. Westgate. So, you're my intro. So, who took it? Bitch, I don't know. Some, obviously, some thugs. Who else could it be? But yes, I'm going to phone the but now of course you guys let me just tell you something i do not for one believe everything that umosa kaula is saying on this particular video because considering how much of a bigger um blogger he is i cannot believe that he only relies on one gadget if one gadget breaks then you use the other one like i angi kola lento i show you line he could have just said something else i'm taking a break or whatever the case but having one phone as a blogger it just does not really make sense at all to me now on to the next is in dabazabantu guys yo bazebam shaza abafana ulondi london kota na ulondi london Ama thugs uyawa tanda guys. So uh Isande World has reported uh, that allegedly uh Ama police the police have confiscated a hijacked BMW at 330i, which is believed to have been driven by a reality TV star and Usinga Ulondi Zulu that is popularly known as Ulondi London. Gifunda straight from Ipepa, guys. I think him Sabashe Mumabong. So Batila Penagu Sunday World the car which is similar to the one the boastful Zulu um, flaunted on social media in March last year, was allegedly hijacked in KwaZulu Natal and handed over to her by an ex-boyfriend, Yake Uspamandla Mabonga, you guys. And unfortunately, as we all saw, Ulondi London went on to social media to boast about it, stating that, yes, it's ngam kleba osis... <laughs> <laughs> yes, in as much as Besim Klega Ogutu Uzulu left and even took his car with when he was leaving her, she got yet another boyfriend, Umabonga Kanti Itagyo Kala Neo Kabela Kesana. One titak angayo ke lo BMA biwe u itiki sande world u... Spamanda Lona has been charged with two counts of attempted murder and it being in possession of an unlicensed firearm Bafuetu. So honestly, I don't know how to feel about this one. Ulondi London, Yabatan and Jabandaba snacks. What are your thoughts, guys? Please let's engage and I will surely see you on the next one.